New at five, Pillow Talk. When was the last time you gave your bedroom pillow a good look? Chances are it's a little bit dingy and for some it can even smell a little bit funky. Whether you have memory foam or feathers, 12 in size Marilyn Moore shows us a little pillow TLC. Your pillow probably does a lot for you, so it may be time to do something for it. Pillows can harbor a lot of gross and icky things. Probably not what you want to hear. Over time, a lot of gross stuff builds up in your pillow. We're talking about sweat, body oil, dirt, saliva, even dust mites and mold. Consumer Report says there's an easy fix to keep your pillow fresh. Start with a good fluffing every day to get rid of dust and to restore its shape. Every month, hang your pillows outdoors for a few hours. If you can't, run them through the dryer on the no heat cycle. Many pillows are washable, but take a close look at the labels before your pillow takes the plunge. The agitators and traditional top loader machines can be a little bit rough on pillows. Front loading machines are a bit gentler, so you just want to leave it in there on the gentle cycle for just a few minutes or the shortest setting possible. Washing two at a time will help balance the load. No matter what type pillow you prefer, she says a pillow cover is a good idea. You wash it right along with your pillowcases. After washing, dry completely or you could get mildew. Tossing two clean tennis balls or dryer balls because nobody likes a clumpy, lumpy pillow. Marilyn Moritz, KSAT 12 News.